And we're back and this time I'm going to show you how to create an optical illusion text in Adobe Photoshop. We need two elements, the text itself and, and a layer that we are going to use for the layer mask of the text. First let's create the text with the type tool. Press C for that. Type it in and move it around with the move tool. It works with every font but I use Bookman Old Star. If you want to center it, press Ctrl A and then use the top menu, press Ctrl D to deselect it. Now right click on the text layer and convert it to a smart object. I will use other offset filter, horizontal and vertical values is something that's dependent on the size of the text and the canvas, so play a little bit around with it. Then double click on this little icon on the right side and change the blending mode of the filter to multiply. We need another offset filter. This time it's all plus values. So in the first example I used minus and then I use the same values but with a minus sign for each, so vertical and horizontal. And now we've got this effect. Once again I've changed the blending mode to multiply and now we need a new layer to create. The layer for the layer mask. Make it white with the paint bucket tool and a white foreground color. Then right click convert it to smart object. We want to use the filter gallery now and we'll add the halftone pattern. So under sketch we'll find that, play a bit around with the size and the contrast. Let me crank that out fully in this example. On a pattern type you must choose line obviously as we want to have these lines. Now let me crank the contrast up as well fully, I'll just press ok, that's the first step. Second step is to use a distortion, which is called wave. Once again, the values they differ depending on the size. Just play a bit around with it until you've got these wavy lines. And as it's a smart object, you can always double click on the filter and adjust it further. The last step for this is the lens correction on the filter. Go to custom and change the angle to 45. And we've got these diagonal wavy lines. Alright, now go to the channel, hold control and click on the RGB channel. If we make that invisible you can see it is our selection now. Go to the text layer and then click on layer mask. And this is the effect that it creates. If you're not happy with the results, I want to adjust it a little bit and I'll show you this. Press Ctrl Z to undo it, then press Ctrl D to deselect, go back to the wavy lines layer and then double click on the halftone pattern effect and we want to go down with the size. That looks better, let me try this. So again I go to channels, hold Ctrl, click on the RGB to make the selection, make it invisible then Activate the text layer and click on layer mask. And this is how you can create these optical illusion text effects in Adobe Photoshop. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.